what what additional studies are you going to get? If I am going reversal or arthroplasty, I'll get a CT scan uh, for preoperative planning um, and and to characterize the deformity. If I'm thinking anatomic in any way, uh, fat or uh, any way in, in general, I will always get an MRI. And there's always the question, well, you can look at Goutelier classification on your CT scan, but the benefit of the MRI gives you the quality of the tendon. Uh, and I'm better at reading fatty infiltration atrophy on an MRI. But I think the quality of the tendon is very important, especially when you're going to do an anatomic shoulder arthroplasty. Uh, specifically for this patient who's 79, if, if her activity uh, levels and demands warrant an anatomic shoulder arthroplasty, I would always get an MRI to look at the soft tissues. As uh, Dr. Virk had said, this is a soft tissue operation, uh, but I'm always getting a CT scan because the value of preoperative planning.